Madrid, the capital derby, so much at stake when Real face Atletico. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, I think we know what we're in for, whatever the circumstances that exist when these two meet. Losing really isn't an option. Making this another intense, feisty clash, which should keep everyone on edge. The fans are more nervous than the players, to me, confirming an atmosphere of, of angst. Try telling them there's nothing riding on this. We're underway. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, David Alaba. One of the most versatile players out there. He's just got so much positional awareness and intelligence. He can basically do a job anywhere on this pitch. He's got fabulous technique too, especially with his delivery in and around the area. He'll be eyeing up any set plays the opposition concede in that defensive third. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. OK, Carrasco, now it's Carrasco, has a pop! Lamar. Morata. Hits one! Valverde goes looking. And now the breakaway. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. But what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Little doubt, that is a foul. And no surprise, that's a booking. Do you think he's feeling the effects of that tackle? Driven straight at the wall. Gets wrestled off the ball. Llorente, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Hosselu. Just starting to get the first signs of rain here. Alaba. Fran Garcia. Fran Garcia has got himself a free kick. Hosselu. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's Morata. Breaks on here. Morata. He's left his man. Goes for goal. Grabbing that opening goal so close to half time, too, affords them that extra little psychological edge. And once one of your main men that's doing the damage, it just grows the togetherness and it grows the spirit. Atletico Madrid are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter attacking heaven. Atletico Madrid draw first blood here. Well, just listen to the reaction. It's the whistle for half-time. 
So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But it still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up today. What's the first half compared with your expectation? Atletico Madrid clearly are benefiting from their homework. They've dealt with anything that's been thrown at them and have been smart on the break. Atletico Madrid are in at half time with a slender one goal lead. Already up and running for the second half. Well, he's had a shot! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Atletico Madrid have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Poké puts his foot on the gas. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Rest the Ball's loose, who's getting there? Correa looking to get on the end of this. He's gone for it! And for a moment, time stood still. So here comes the substitution. Intercepts it really alerts the danger. Now it's Griezmann. Griezmann has a pop. It's there. Two to the good. They have breathing space. What a great finish! But how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. starting to look very comfortable that second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods i mean one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three and the assistant referee rightly gives him offside keeper's got good distance on that Real Madrid have a free kick. Loses his balance and loses the ball. There's a long ball. He spotted the run and played him through. Correa. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Lamar. Hossalou. Better of his opposite number. Oh, it's taken out, that'll be a foul. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, what goes through a player's head at times like that is a mystery to me. And it's Modric. Saul. Correa tries to stroke it through. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Atletico Madrid gain victory here, and on balance they were worth it. Well, 